are on now. This is what we call it the Ring Road. A highway that goes around Cairo and Giza. And usually we are using this Ring Road to avoid the traffic. Because we have a very busy traffic here in Cairo and Giza. We are talking about 7.5 million cars in the streets of Cairo and Giza here. That's why we have a very busy traffic, okay? Each one of these is about 15 tons. Now, I'm gonna give you a free time to go up like this. You can go up some of the steps and take a couple of pictures. Okay, take a photo. 19, 20, 21, 22. At the bus, when we were in the bus, that the length of the facade of these pyramids like this is 230 meters and the length of each side from one point to another is 230 meters like this an equilateral triangle 230 meters 230 meters with a perfect angle the 50 degrees 51 minutes and because of that when the sun is on the top of these pyramid there is no shadow at all for this massive construction. The base of the pyramid, the four corners, are oriented to the four cardinal points. That is the northern corner, okay? The eastern corner, the western, where the sun sets over there, and the southern corner on the other side. That massive construction, what we are looking at now, it contains 2.3 million 
to 2.8 million blocks of stones. It's a solid, massive construction. The blocks, what you are looking at now, all the blocks are limestone blocks. They are different in size and weight. The blocks at the base, each block is about 15 tons or 15,000 kilograms. And it's getting lighter when we go up to the top. The top blocks, each one is about two tons or 2,000 kilograms. So the upcoming question is gonna be how they built the pyramid, how they moved those heavy blocks like this. Look at, look, look at the picture. The ancient Egyptians, when they started building these pyramids, they leveled the bedrock very well. And then they built a ramp, a loop ramp that goes around the four sides of the pyramid. That ramp was built out of mud, the mud of the Nile. And they let it dry under the sun. Once the ramp is dry, they started to put oil on this ramp to reduce the friction. For palm trees, trunks, they use it to roll up these blocks. People are pushing these blocks and strong animals like oxen are pulling those heavy blocks up on this ramp which goes around the four sides of the pyramid like this. How long it took to build a pyramid like that? It took 20 years to build this pyramid and almost 100,000 workers a day. People were working here, 100,000 workers a day for 20 years to finish this pyramid for their king, for their divine king. Now we're gonna go closer to those blocks to see how big are those blocks and how they put the blocks 